Hey guys, Hannah 99 here. Welcome back to episode 2 of my Minecraft Survival Let's Play series. So, <clears throat> last time we left off, I built this uh, decent house, and uh, obviously there's no roof, and there's a flower in here. Don't know how that happened, but yeah, we've got a uh, copper now, um, and maybe we should continue with the iron now. There we go. Now let's see if we can find some glass, because that'd be kind of cool. Just a little bit. Maybe heal up. Right, well, we're not going to find any glass, but we will find sand, so let's go look for that. Which it looks like there is a scary cave down there, and some sand up here. Which is perfect, and it looks like extra coal, but I don't care. I think I'm going to use clear glass because that's what I usually use. But today we're going to be doing a little bit of mining. I'm obviously not going to waste an entire episode on mining because mining is cool at the beginning and then gets very boring after that. So if there's anything exciting, I will uh, uh, bring it back up. Uh, what is this? Is this supposed to look like some abandoned village or something? <clears throat> it's kind of interesting. Oh, it's like a little cave thing. Can I reach those without going down there? Because I'm sure it's a booby trap. Oh, I guess not. Ow, I'll take some of this. I'll just take the uh, chests because I don't have to pick up the items out of it. Seems like it's mostly the same kind of item, but take it. Is there really a mob up there? What is this? Thatch? Hmm. You know, I will... Hey, there's a village. You know, I will take this, though. Um, these would be nice. Potatoes and wheat and stuff. Mostly potatoes. I guess beetroot is from Minecraft, so... Uh, let's see. You can also go down here. I think there's a secret chest, but we'll leave that for later, because... I don't really feel like going down there right now. But, uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and keep going. I think I have enough glass, but let me look actually really quick. How do you make uh, clear glass? Do I have to use Tinker's Construct? Okay, well, uh, let's look at extra utilities. I hate how the search doesn't let you do that. It's so annoying. <sighs> okay, well, since I can't search because NEI doesn't work like it used to, um, let me just go ahead and throw some of this in there. Uh, you know what? Maybe we can start a farm. Let's get a bucket going. So then we can start that. And we do have iron, so I will make a iron shovel or an iron hoe and an iron pickaxe. Because I can. What? Apparently there was an iron sword in there. I didn't even notice that. Anyway, okay, so let's uh start a farm. There's water over here, so that's convenient. I think I'll put it over here, because it's easier to get to. I think it's getting dark now, but that's okay. Alright, so we'll start the farm here. Two, three, four, five, and then one, two, three, four, and then this will be the middle. Alright. What? Oh, it's a worm. 
Okay. I think this is the maximum size. I don't remember, though. It's not the end of the world, though. Oh, that's cool. Didn't know. I don't know what mod adds to that, but... It's pretty neat. And let's hurry up and finish this so I can sleep before... All hell breaks loose out here. Alright. Sleepy, sleepy, sleep. Alright. Um. So let's plant. I I'm probably just going to stick with potatoes solely because that's just easy. Because um, that's really all I actually eat. It's the, it's. I think it's the food with the most, or the the, um, growable food with the most saturation. Uh, all right. So let's get rid of extra stuff that I don't need. Uh, we'll start cooking up the glass because it looks like I'm going to be using regular glass. And maybe a few more torches. And we have our iron pick right here. I'll stick with the stone one until we run out of uh, materials. Do I have any food in here that I can just eat? Mm, no. Oh, that's a rip, I guess. I don't have any more stones, so let's uh, get cobble so I can make a second furnace. I guess I could always just start mining. Um, I'll start it over here. Just keep going. I'm gonna make it larger than the smallest possible so that it's not annoying to go up and down. Is it worth getting? What is this appetite? Yeah. I don't think I've ever used appetite in my entire life for anything. But, uh, ooh, sandstone. Oh, this is limestone. I was like, there's no beach or desert around here. Uh, okay. Random creeper damage sound. Good to know. Wonder where that's coming from. Hopefully I don't run into whatever that is. Brutal ore. And there's a beehive around here, too. I'm just gonna try to keep going down. Oh, there's some Certus Quartz. My favorite ore in the whole game. <clears throat> I think this pack has Applied Energistics, too, as well as uh like refined storage which i always thought what 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 is the point of having both in your mod pack cuz they both do pretty much the same thing although i think applied energistics implementation is better but uh anyway it does not really matter i usually use ae anyway But uh, we're at Y35 right now. We've got some more coal, which is good, because we're going to need that for more torches. Looks like we found magnesium ore from nuclear craft. Not sure. I think they must have updated this pack since I last played it, because I don't remember the nu I don't remember nuclear craft being in here.
Oh, an abandoned mine shaft. Would you look at that? That might have been what we were hearing. Do I have a sword? I do. Then I can mine that, and then we can actually get down there. I'll just turn to the side like this. And hope we don't die. I should probably uh, empty out part of my inventory, but... Eh. Alright. There are a lot of ores added by this mod. Well, there's some nice iron ore right here. I'll take it. Obviously, we're going to be doing a little bit of mining by hand, but <clears throat> what are you going to do? It's kind of the grind of modded anyways. You have to mine a bunch of uh, ores all at once. But uh, I guess I'll keep it rolling for while we explore the uh, mine shaft for a little bit. Let's see, we're 11 minutes in now. Uh, this stupid bat keeps flying right in front of my face. There we go. I don't think that was worth picking up, but you never know. Yeah, I'm trying all the secret buttons that normally are vein mine, and they don't seem to be doing anything. So... When I cut away, I might check to see if there are any other vein mine, or if there is vein mine. But, uh, I don't think so. I don't remember it being in this pack. It looks like we exposed a new part of the shaft just from mining. So that's cool. And here's some tin. Um, let's get a little more light in here, more iron. It's always good to have. Let's see. Keep digging for coal. Should have quite a bit now. Looks like my inventory is almost full. So we'll have to take care of that here in a minute. Uh, let's put that there. Apparently that makes a grass sound when you jump on it. Um, there's more Certus Quartz down here. Or, well, it was actually up here, but... Let's see if I can find it. Here it is. And we'll grab that copper. I don't think I have any inventory space for it, though. Yeah, charge Certus Quartz. Yeah, okay. Well, um, I'm going to em empty my inventory, and I'll be right back. Okay, we're back, and I emptied my inventory for the most part, made a few more torches. Oh, that's probably where those other guys are. So to prevent a mass exodus, I'm going to block that off just in case. So let's go down here and... Got some coal. Can't ever have too much coal because we'll probably, at the start, we're going to need it for power. So, might as well have it for that. Um, let's see. Let me clear this up a little bit. Might be useful so that I can walk. There we go. 
All right, let's keep exploring this. See if we can find anything, any more interesting stuff. There's clay here. I don't know how the clay spawns that low down, but when in doubt, it's probably a mod that's doing it. There's a ravine here. Eat a little. Oh, I almost walked to my death. Okay, well now they're fighting. Except I got knocked off, so I'm just gonna have to kill him now. Get some more Certus Quartz here. And there's iron. I'll take that. So the first thing I like to do when I, oh, there's one of those Thomcraft things. The first thing that I like to do um, when I get enough resources to build one of those, uh, oh, what are they called, uh, like grindstones, I think. And you can do pretty cheap and dirty uh, ore doubling that way. Um, it's all manual, but it, it's kind of nice because you can get twice as many ores for the same amount of work. So, and you do need quartz for that, so I'd recommend collecting that. I forgot these things give you. Come on, I forgot these things give you poison. Let me see if I can uncover it. What the? literally gonna die. Trying to get over here and block it off, but... Jesus, these things hurt. Probably should make some armor. But luckily this guy's too stupid, so I think we just need to grab the items and go. Otherwise I will die. And I forget which I think it's this way. Okay, perfect. So let's get up up there so I don't die. So that'd be great. Maybe we'll go in that cave later, but Oh, so let me see if I have the stuff to craft it first, and then we can take a look at uh, working through that. And I should have more food here. Yeah, okay. Let's get rid of some of this stuff that I've already collected. Okay, so it's called a grindstone, I believe. Quartz grindstone. So you need a wood gear, certus quartz, cobblestone, and then regular stone. How do I only have seven cobblestone? That is not that does not go in there. Okay. Um so let's go ahead and get smelting. That's not where that goes. Okay. So we've got that going, and then we need uh the wooden gear. Is that the only kind of wooden gear that we can make, I guess? It's, it's wood around sticks. So let's go ahead and craft that. No, it's not what I want. Okay, so there's that. I need three of this. And I think... Uh, I'm not sure how many of that we need, but I think that should be all. Okay, so we got a grindstone, and then we actually need more sticks for the handle portion, which looks like that. And then you just plop that down. And what you do is, let's say you want to double your iron, you 
put that in and you just hold right click on this and no it's not very easy to automate um, but you just right click on this and you'll have basically iron dust um, you want to be careful though because if you just like put a book on your mouse and walk away if you uh, run it while it's empty like there are no items in it then it will destroy the handle and it'll just break so uh, keep that in mind unless you have a machine to place the handles down or you know that you're not going to run out of items then uh, in theory you could actually do that but uh, I'll come back when this is all done okay so I got pretty much all the ores uh, pulverize that we needed so they're just kind of cooking up right here now what I want to do is go and get some more wood um, because I want to make the furnace more or less automated so that I can just throw a bunch of dust in there and then I don't have to worry about it but in order to actually do that I'm going to need a little bit more wood because I'm out of uh, wood. So I'm going to go ahead and solve that really quick. And then probably um, off camera I will uh, do some more mining and uh, get some stuff after this is over. Oh, lucky day. My, my axe broke, so that's cool. But uh, that way you guys don't have to watch me for hours because mining it usually takes a while. The other thing I thought about potentially doing is um, having actual like a live stream some of the episodes, which obviously would probably be longer than 30 minutes, but you never know. Okay, so I'm going to attach that there. I will steal this furnace and place it here and then I will have a hopper here and we can just put the dust in there and that way we don't waste any fuel well we will waste less fuel than we normally would have now it appears that aluminum doesn't go in there but let, let's see if these other ores do it looks like not so we'll just kind of leave it as is for now um, and we're gonna need to put some of this stuff away not really sure what chelicere is gonna be used for but oh I guess that's the, that's the other thing I could do is I can go plant these cotton seeds because we will definitely uh, benefit from having those planted I'm just going to use the same place where I have the potatoes just because I already have it set up. There we go. And we've already got some potatoes. Just go ahead and spread those out a little more. And maybe we can clear out some of this grass in front of here. Three cotton seeds. There we go. Plant that down. Now uh, let's go and get rid of these seeds. There we go. And uh, I think that's all the planting that we'll be doing for right now. <clears throat> but at least we have a good start on ores. Um, no diamonds yet, unfortunately. If we do find some, we could actually go over to that uh, meteor and um, see what's inside. Because then we might be able to get an earlier start on uh, applied energistics, which would be kind of kind of nice. Uh, what should I do? I suppose I could make another axe and uh, get some more wood. I'm going to need more than that which is all of our iron, so we should probably go get some more. Let's 
See if I can finish cutting down that tree. Seems to be going pretty good. All right. And then I'm thinking I can like flatten some of these areas out when we need more room for buildings and such. But we'll see. Eventually I'd like to go to the, uh, well, what is it called? I forget what dimension it is. That, uh, not applied energy, uh, extra utilities adds. Um, the last dimension, I think, is what it's called. Something like that. Um, because it's basically a free void world. And that's a nice world to be able to build a base in. So I may try that. Um, that might be a little bit interesting to see. Uh, okay. Let's see. Some saplings over here that we can grab really quick. Um, that'll probably be enough wood for now, I think. So we'll go ahead and save that over in here. Our chest is almost full. I guess I could plant this uh, last bit of little cotton seeds that we've got going on here. Wow, some of these are already all the way grown. All right. And now I can heal up. Oh yeah, I also made some iron armor for myself because uh, reasons. I didn't want to keep almost dying down there. So that should be pretty beneficial. Um, I guess we have bones now, so I can make that. This needs to not be in there. That should be in there. And then, so this chest is just going to be like uh, smelted ingots and things and ores that I can't do anything with right now or don't want to do anything with. So it looks like that's all processed. Uh, I guess we can add the windows now, so let's go ahead and do that. And uh, I think we're out of iron. Yeah, so I can't make any more, but that'll work for now. And we do have more wood, so I could start with the roof. And let me actually craft a ladder for that. Or make a ladder so we can get up. That should actually probably just, that'll be enough. I'm going to make the uh, ceiling three blocks tall. And that way we don't have to worry about uh, dive bombings from spiders or anything. And then maybe uh, between episodes I can fix the floor because it's all grass right now. Uh, I used to put skylights in my house, but uh, it's a lot of glass, and there's not a ton of sand around, so I think I'll just kind of leave it as is for now. Yeah, I'm going to need more wood, definitely. Let's see if we can get some nice lighting going on here. Try to get these evenly spaced. There we go. That should keep most of the things set up. Let me see. What's the button for... Uh, I don't remember what the... Oh, okay. This will work. Yeah, that's not going to be good. Okay. There we go. So, that's uh, F4, which is... These numbers are just the light levels, and you want them to be above seven so if there's a number that means mobs can spawn there let's go ahead and sleep because we can I should probably close the door because they're gonna come in if I don't uh, but uh, yeah 
Let's get this last little bit of wood placed down. That'll keep spiders from coming in. But uh, I think I'll cut it off here. So hopefully between this episode and next I can do a little bit more mining. And then also finish up the uh, house, the roof, and maybe the floor. The floor is not as important as the roof though. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.